In this tutorial, we're going to show how to combine two videos to make an interesting presentation using the Green Screen by Doink app. We recommend you start first with the bottom layer and build up. Since our presentation is about the weather, we're going to use a weather video as our background on the bottom timeline. On the middle timeline, we're going to place a video of our student recorded in front of a green screen. We're using a stock video for our background, so we're going to want to trim off portions so we can start at the point in the video that we want. To do this, grab the square handle in the front of the timeline and drag it to the right. You will note that the video in the display window changes as you do this, showing the video at the point in which you have moved the cursor line. When finished, drag the clip back to time zero. Now we add the student video to the middle layer. We want to match the timeline durations of both videos, so we'll need to trim the weather video at the end. To do this, tap the video on the bottom timeline. Then drag the square handle at the end of the video to the left until it matches the duration of the student video. Move the timelines back to the starting point at the zero mark. Now we want to export our video. To do this, we first need to compose our two image sources together into a single video. Tap the Save button above the timelines. A progress bar will appear that says Exporting Your Project. Be patient, it may take a little time. When the app has finished compiling, a window will appear enabling you to preview the video, export, or save to your camera roll. Let's first preview it. And as you in TV to make it look like your local news guy, is standing in front of a weather map. If satisfied with what we see, then we save it to our camera roll. Success. A window will appear when the video has been successfully saved. At any point, we can tap Done to return to the project editor. That's it. A fun and easy way to edit and save two videos into one very cool presentation.